So this is the hard drive where I'd stored this footage for about a year. I was going to release it soon after my original UFO footage, but for some reason or another, I forgot. And a few days ago, I was having a tidy up and I found this hard drive and I played the footage again and I realized the significance of what I captured. So that's the reason why I'm gonna share this video footage with you now. So hopefully somebody out there can explain what exactly is this latest mysterious UFO sighting is. So without further ado, let's check it out. So here is the time-lapse video, which I made six days after my original UFO time-lapse footage, which is already uploaded onto my YouTube channel. And just like the first recording, I let this time-lapse record overnight and into the early hours of the morning. And there are a few things moving around at high speed in this video. And I think one of those objects is the International Space Station and the other flying objects might be meteorites. But the most interesting object by far comes towards the end of this video when the morning light starts to come through. And we're getting to that point now. So if you focus your eyes on the top right hand side of the screen, because it happens very quickly. I don't know if you saw that. So let me show you again and I'll slow down to 10% of the original speed. There you go. And now I'll slow it down even further to 5% of the original speed and I'll zoom in as well. And here's some zoomed in snapshots of this object from this original video. I initially thought this was a satellite, but surely a satellite wouldn't be as clear as this. I would have thought a satellite would appear as just a white dot. But this has a definite structure to it, it looks metallic, it's moving at high speed, but it doesn't look like a plane, it doesn't look like the International Space Station, so I'm really not sure what it is. If you know what it is, please let me know, and thanks for watching.